This is Katie and Weekend Prime. Many thanks for staying with us. Now, a long and seemingly frustrating journey for nearly 200 squatters in Embu County has come to an end after residents of Karuku Village in Bere South constituency were relocated from a graveyard where they had settled for 32 years. The three-decade-long standoff precipitated precipitated by accusations of illegal settlement within the Makutana Junction area, has now seen residents awarded an eighth of an acre piece of land each. Timothy Oteno reports. When KTN News visited the residents of Karuku village back in January this year, they were not a happy lot. Every morning, children here woke up to sites of several graveyards spread across their compound. At the time, they had no choice but to live here. <laughs> but now, six months later, they all gather in anticipation for a new life. <laughs> The area member of parliament, Geoffrey Kingangi, has finalized documents for a 10-acre parcel of land that will be subdivided into two parts, one to host this vocational center and the other to host more than 150 villagers who once lived at a nearby graveyard. Sisi, kuna kitu tulijua inaendelea kwa ishamba. Ishamba ilikuwa inauzwa. they quickly begin construction, not because they are desperate, but rather because they are wise. Their wisdom brought about by the fact that twice before, land that had been allocated for their resettlement was allegedly grabbed, forcing them to spend more nights next to the dead. Hata kama ni mahali kidogo tunafurahia maana tuko na mahali pa kuishi mahali pazuri. Tulikuwa pale ukichimba cho, ukichimba ikifika piti ine, tano unatoa msipa wa mtu. Mengine unakutana na kichwa ya mtu. Hakuna cho, tulikuwa tunaishi mahali pa chafu sana. Lakini wakati huu tunashukuru tunasema Mungu ambariki. Ni ambaye aliona ni vizuri hii shamba hiyo ya shule na ni yeye mwenye kununua mtaka msini akaona ni vizuri anunue iwe ya shule na pandile ingini iwe ya masquatters wale walikuwa makawane shule na wale walikuwa kaburini pale yeye na sasa badala baada ya kukaa sana akatoka katika eh, kazi yake kabra hajapatiana na sasa baadaye ndiye Mungu akafani akafanya aka mafanikio ile jambo ikatimizika but today they are ensuring that the land they have been issued with is not stolen the women here express joy over what will now be their new home. They will no longer have to live among the dead. Timothy Otieno, KTN News.